Well, I think I always knew I was going to be in design in some way, shape, or form. And when I was young, I used to um, spend days at the library. My mom would take me and uh, just spend hours with landscape design and architecture books. It's both um, Asian architectural influence, mid-century modern architecture, and a bit of a craftsman influence as well. Um, I also see a bit of, um, have a bit of influence from nature. I, I tend to emulate a lot of um, shapes and elements I see in nature, whether that be branches or leaves, um, but stylized, a bit of a contemporary edge on those ideas come up in, in my designs quite often. My creative process, um, I tend to find that I, when I'm outdoors, that's when I want to be sketching most. And so I'll sketch in the park, sketch wherever I can spend some time outdoors, and then those sketches go back to the studio with me and get translated into, um, into the metal and into a prototype. And sometimes the, the design changes a little bit along the way, and um, as you engineer the shapes and the elements, what was on paper tends to change as you work it into a piece that will work functionally. Um, but that's part of the challenge I like as well, is engineering something to uh, hang the way you want it to or to be composed the way you want it to. The piece I'm wearing right now is called Tumble, and it was conceived as a sketch. Um, I, I like presence. I like a lot of visual presence in my jewelry, and whether that takes form um, in more of a structured piece or something that just has a lot of visual presence to it like this piece does. Um, the sketch happened first and then once in the studio I was able to um, determine the best stones to use in the materials. It's sterling silver, um, black onyx, and black agate. And uh, the name actually came as an inspiration from the stones because they have a very tumbled look to them. Um, and it's uh, a piece that I tend to wear very often. It's one of my regular pieces. I have fun doing what, I'm, what I do, and I hope that comes across. Um, while the pieces can be very structured, I think there's also a bit of whimsy in them. Um, and I think that's where I hope the fun shows through. Um, you know, I say that my, my work hopefully helps every woman express themselves in a certain way, express a bit of what's on the inside with the world outside. I chose Beyond Tradition to work with um, here in Austin to showcase our designs really because of the, uh, the philosophy they have about working with the designers as well as the, um, the sense of style that the store presents. Um, and it seemed like there was a very good niche for my line in the store and um, I feel like that the the owners of the store really get working with the designers and really get working with the people of Austin.